We are going camping this weekend and I am going grocery shopping. I'm gonna try to get two dinners, two breakfasts, some snacks for under 50 bucks at a place you might not think to go buy food to go camping. Hey everyone, my name is Patrick and this is Travels with Delaney, your channel all about RVing and living life to the fullest. And let's so go see if we can get all this food for under $50 at Trader Joe's. Now the first thing you see when you come in at Trader Joe's is an amazing selection of flowers and plants, but we're gonna skip that today. It's winter here in the Midwest, so I'm not gonna be grilling outside or cooking on the campfire. So we need to find things that are easy to cook, that are gonna be good, and I wanna do it for under 50 bucks. I'm headed specifically to start with over here to the dairy because we need to think about breakfast. We like their Greek vanilla yogurt, 329, perfect size for weekend camping. We're gonna go ahead and add that for breakfast. I think we need some bread for breakfast too, but oh my. We're gonna need dessert, chocolate mousse, Valentine's cake, 449. They also have raspberry heart cookies. What are these? Raspberry mousse cakes for $3.99. You know what? They're bite size. I like these for $3.99. There we go. We got dessert. Now bread options, all kinds of bread options. We got bagels, English muffins, but I tell you what we really like. These British style crumpets, $2.99. You get six of them, so there's Saturday breakfast. Sunday breakfast, and we have two left over we can have as a snack. You can just put butter on them, or you could uh, put jelly. It's really your choice. We need some bread. Not seeing the bread I want. Um, they have this olive bread sometimes, but I am not seeing it, so no problem. I like to come in when they first open at 8 a.m. because otherwise the store is always so busy. But when I come in first thing in the morning, I can look, get what I want, and get in, get out. First breakfast item. They have this quiche Lorraine, $5.49 um, for this quiche, but we always get two meals out of it because we pair it with like our yogurts and things. So we're gonna get one of those to go with breakfast. Let's come over here. Now, I love things like this uh, rigatoni, they have, oh, this asparagus risotto for $3.49 is really good. Their, their gnocchi at uh, $3.49 is a good deal. Um, but this is what I want. Their fettuccine alfredo, $3.89 for this pack. Two tablespoons of water in a skillet. That's all you have to do. That's going to be one of our meals. Now, I want to add some chicken to that, so we're going to go right on down here to the end of this cooler. Luckily, I know where everything is. And let's see if they have, oh, wah, wah, wah. Normally, they have a teriyaki chicken that I like to add. But this is going to be our meal on Friday night. Look at this, shiitake chicken mushroom, $5.99. Um, we also like the meat broccoli. It is a little spicy though. We just use our own teriyaki sauce. And normally, they do have a chow mein for $4.99. And the fried rices are good as well. Now we're gonna need some rice. And I like these now. They're, they come frozen for $4.29. So we're gonna have plenty of rice. We can use this maybe a couple times this weekend, even for a lunch. So that's gonna go with that shiitake mushroom. I'm still on the hunt for some kind of protein to go with my fettuccine. Sometimes when we're eating these um, like Asian meals, we like to have something to go with them, kind of as almost like an appetizer. And we get these vegetable spring rolls. Now these we like because I think you get five in here and at 429, actually we're not gonna eat all five, so it'll end up being maybe a snack at some point. Now they do have fresh meat here, so I could just buy some chicken breast or um, some sausage to go with it. But I really wanted something that was like pre-cooked just to make it easier. So I'm gonna keep looking. I'm also gonna ask, sometimes if you ask, they'll look in the back and see what, they may have things in the back. Wow, more sweets. Look at these lava cakes, 379. I really, I'm really thinking I want some of these at 379. Pop these in the toaster oven, those will be good. Lots of good selections. They have a great selection of like frozen pizzas. I don't think I'm gonna get one for this weekend, but this is what I'm gonna get. Since they don't have that olive bread, these Portuguese dinner rolls 
are wonderful. Just heat them up in the toaster oven. And at $2.99, we'll take those. Now, if you like oatmeal, we like their oatmeal, their instant oatmeal. They have a great selection. I mean, look at this, maple pecan granola. $3.29, but we already have some of that in the RV pantry. We also like some of just their cereals if I wanted to take milk. Um, these frosted shredded bite-sized wheats. Okay, sometimes we get, you know, the munchies. $2.99 for these Trader Joe Jojos. I think of them as Oreos. It looks like they also have a, a vanilla one. Um, throughout the year, they'll have different flavors at Christmas. I love their uh, peppermint ones, but all right. Okay, we did ask and they are out of the chicken. So, I think what we're gonna do, I know this is gonna blow the budget, I'm sure of it. Let's splurge, let's get for $7.99 these Argentinian shrimp. Those will be awesome, that'll be plenty. I'm afraid I just blew my budget, but here's the thing. If you go out for a nice dinner, you're gonna spend at least 50 bucks. And we're trying to cook the entire weekend for 50 bucks. So, one last thing I wanna get. chips and we'll get something crunchy this weekend. Now Trader Joe's has a huge wine selection but I have so much wine at home I don't think I need to buy any today. That should do it. Let's go check out and see did I blow the budget. We'll see. Although maybe I I may be worried here because I think I blew the budget. <laughs> Okay, let's recap what we bought. So we actually have, Friday night, we are going to have the uh, shiitake mushroom chicken stir fry. We have white rice for that. We have egg rolls. That's gonna be Friday night. Um, our breakfast, both Saturday and Sunday, is going to be those British crumpets. We have yogurt. We have that quiche, so we have plenty there. Um, Sunday, or Saturday night, then dinner, we're gonna end up having fettuccine alfredo with those Argentinian shrimp. Mm, gosh, that sounds good. And we have those Portuguese dinner rolls to go with it. And remember, I bought those little bite-sized uh, snack treats. Um, that'll be dessert both nights. And then we have the Sunday morning breakfast. But then I also bought snacks. I have stuff for snacks. I have the JoJo's, the chocolate JoJo cookies if we want something sweet. I have those little um, teriyaki crispy chips if we want. And so I think that's about everything. Um, quite a bit of food. So what was the final total? Did I come in under $50? No. <laughs> and honestly, it was probably the JoJo's and the shrimp, the last things I grabbed. We ended up with all that food for $55.17 with tax. Honestly, again, couldn't go out to eat for probably that for one really nice meal. So we're gonna have excellent food over the weekend in our RV. Now, if you enjoyed this shopping video with me, I'm gonna go ahead and post another video right up here for you to watch next, where we headed over to Ikea and you can find out all the great things we bought there for our RV. Until next time, everybody, we're gonna see you on down the road. <laughs> Bye.